Congratulations, Rising Star, for hitting the Big Ten. My name is Andy Linkosi, and when I won the award in the professional services category, I was a senior manager at PwC. I've since been promoted to associate director in the firm, which is a major milestone for me and my career and where I'm going. Winning the Rising Star Award was a surprise. It was fantastic. This prestigious award provides you with an opportunity to take stock of how far you've come and the fact that you've actually lifted people along your journey. What a fantastic opportunity to be part of the Rising Star. Hi there, my name is Boydumelo Mako and I am a Rising Star alumni of 2018. I won in the media and advertising category back then. And I'd say winning the award has helped me elevate in my leadership role. I went from just being a content producer to being given the title of senior content producer. And also in my side hustle, the business I run, my shady media, I was able to get clients because they respected my accolade as a rising star. Hi, I'm Karen Robb. I was the winner of Rising Star in 2014 in the financial services category. What am I doing now? I am working as a global COO uh, for a microfinance company based in 19 uh, countries around the world. Some words of wisdom for you. Um, do something you're passionate about. Chase experience, chase growth opportunities um, because that's really what makes the difference. My name is Devandre Lawrence and I'm the General Manager for People Operations at Nano South Africa. I'm also the Tourism, Retail and Hospitality Rising Star winner for 2020. Rising Star has given me the opportunity to realize my potential and enable my resilience to thrive. I'd like to encourage you with the quote from my favorite author, Robin Sharma. You were born into the opportunity as well as the responsibility to become legendary. Trust in yourself, know that you can do it, have faith and belief in your capabilities and know that you are already a legend. Hello everyone, Grace Olukune Eskom, Kusile Power Station Chief Engineer. That's what I'm doing now. I won the Rising Star in 2019 Energy and Environment category. It was an amazing experience. I really got to enjoy just the whole process of rediscovering myself and just pushing myself forward. My motto that I still live by even um, now is, will the world be different because I live? So let the world be different because you live, because you are a rising star. Just the fact that you're here and you've been recognized, you got this. Put your best foot forward always. Cheers, bye. My name is Jacques. I am the executive of operational excellence for Unitrans Supply Chain Solutions. And we are based in beautiful Cape Town. In 2019, I had the opportunity to partake in the Accenture Rising Star Awards and I was very fortunate to walk away with uh, accolades from the logistics and security sector. The Accenture Rising Star Awards is, was a beautiful journey for me. Um, obviously, walking away with the accolade, which was a beautiful trophy and an experience that I will treasure forever. Um, I've actually got the photo right here to prove that. That's the final evening um, photo kept quite proudly in my office. But I think more so, the journey was really important to me for two reasons. It asked of me to really reflect on who I am as a person, um, specifically from a leadership perspective, both internal and to those people that I lead in our organization. But it also asked of me to take a long, hard look of, at what my responsibility is in order to use my God-given talent to lead and how do I embed um, my direct teams and my community at large. So you've made it very far down this process. Congratulations, celebrate yourselves, really enjoy this moment, but realize that you do have a responsibility to use your talent, um, to give back to the community and your direct teams, and even to give back to yourself. Realize the capability that you have to internally lead to self-reflect and improve yourselves, and use that capability to be the best version of yourself day in, day out. So celebrate this moment. Again, congratulations and um, enjoy the beautiful journey that's ahead of you um, with you being a leader in your own rights. Hi, I'm Kate Whitley. Presently, I'm a franchise director at Discovery. In 2012, I was privileged enough to be the recipient of the Rising Star Award, specifically for the finance category. If I reflect on that evening, um, the emotion that ran deep was excitement, 
and grateful, and I couldn't actually believe that I had won the award. Um, the opportunity that the award had presented to me over the last 10 years was it created a platform for me to network with other individuals that had excelled within their fields. And just sort of understanding what they've done um, in terms of paying it forward, which has placed me in a position to sort of develop other programs and other initiatives. To Laura and her team, you've done an amazing job. It's been an amazing 10 years just to see how you've actually brought to the forefront um, and you showcase some of the most incredible people in South Africa. I'm incredibly proud of what you've achieved and I wish you only the best going forward. My name is Sabelo Mieni, founder and CEO of Sisegendo Institute of Business and Technology, a company that focuses on training and development. Winning the Rising Star Award in 2018 was such an honor and a great feeling for me. My advice to any potential future rising star is that you continue working hard, be passionate about what you do, and one day the world will recognize your efforts. Good day. My name is Terence Nkosi, one of the winners in the honorable class in the mining and minerals category. The rising star has opened up doors for me in ways that I would have not never thought of. I got to meet some of the world leading industry people in my field and they got to mentor and coach me. Second, it has helped me to focus to help other people to do better than I am. As the sign says, this is about the rising star, which is, means that you illuminate light in darkness so that other people can emerge and do much better. So it has helped me to focus on talent and to be able to support communities uh, to do things better so that at the end of my life, I did matter. Thank you, Laura and the team for helping me realize this dream. Good luck to the Rising Stars. Hi, 2021 Rising Star finalists. My name is Noktula Mtecha, and I was the winner of the 2015 Rising Star competition in the energy and chemicals category. I've since moved on from energy and chemicals and I'm in financial services now. What the win meant for me and what it still does mean for me is that I have a right to sit at the table. It has given me so much confidence and added to my professional connections, people that I would have never even thought of meeting in my life. So I wanna encourage you to say, make of this experience what you would make of this experience. You know, it will pay back in leaps and bounds. Just take it in, meet people, make connections, grow. Grow in your leadership and um, the rest, as they say, will be history. Hi folks, my name is Brendan James Hart from Hyatt Hotels Worldwide. Um, I was a fortunate winner of the 2019 Hospitality, Tourism and Leisure Award um, for Rising Stars. And um, what a euphoric feeling it was to win. Um, the main feeling that I had was satisfaction. I felt really privileged to be involved, um, but also that it was an external body that had vetted my capabilities as opposed to an internal organization. I really felt a lot of confidence came from that and that has helped springboard me into a new part of my career. Uh, I've taken on African key accounts as well as European sports groups. And I think some of the connections I made and the confidence that was instilled in me from this um, award um, has really helped um, to develop my career. And that's the advice I would like to pass on to some of the contestants this year is to really delve in. It's gonna be a grueling process, um, but deepen the connections. You know, Make sure that you embrace it and um, enjoy the adventure. Uh, one of the most important things is to have fun with it. Um, so all the best guys and good luck. Cheers.